focused. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Should yeah. I yeah. walk oh, yeah. All right. I'm Sam Lachow, and I have a new album, Brand New Bike, coming out. Fuck, <laughs> <Hot>, man. <laughs> uh, I'm going to need Jack to leave, I think. No. Can you leave? No. And take off my sweatshirt? I'm not going to leave. But you could have smiled. I'm sorry. Bro. I don't have that much film on this, dude. It's rolling. Is it? Yeah. Is it a red dot? Yeah, it's a red dot. Oh. Done. Could you go? No. Uh, Why? Sorry, man. Can you just stop pressing the button? Just roll. It's rolling. Is it the red yeah, light on and shit? red light. Jesus Christ. But I'm it saying, would. <laughs> what? But it's like blinking. It's okay. Know. It should oh, be okay. blinking. It didn't before, but... All right. I am Sam Lachow, and I have a new okay. album uh, called Brand New Bike coming out July in July. Okay. I think July 20th. So Whoa! Stop, dude! Yeah! It's not a Shankbone album anymore because I moved to New York and we all went to different colleges. Uh, so I'm out in New York pretty much putting this together myself. But it's not a solo album in the way that it's not just me doing it. It's me and a whole bunch of different musicians from Seattle and New York and all over the place. And it's Tonight, right here in Numos, first time playing in Numos. First time playing with a completely live band. We got a drummer, <laughs> we got uh, fucking two horns, keyboard players, singers, could be dope. And we're the only we're the only group with a live band. Because that's how my new album is, man. It's just all live instruments. No sampling, no nothing. So when you listen to this shit, you know it's all us. beats from other people I sort of insist I guess I'm a control freak but I insist on producing all my own beats so all the songs on this album are entirely produced by me but it's featuring a, a huge collective of different musicians interesting when you're the one putting the beats together when it's all coming from the same people a lot of rappers they a lot of rap albums each beat is from a different person they're just buying beats from different producers I just find it way more interesting when it's all from the same people and when you're listening to it you know that they all put it together themselves it's still a little hard for me to talk about even though you know what's up and you and I are really talking now and I know the shit you tell me that you wouldn't say when pops around and we still boxing every day and you get back up when I knock you down sometimes it might get hard to understand but man it's all good it's all love it's all blood it's all fam and I know just how it is cause I've been through the same shit all the friends all the chicks middle school that's a bitch sixth grade I'll tell you what those ain't the best days think about girls and writing raps instead of S Let 
me she have to fuck with a square Cause she never find a nigga bosses me anywhere Nah, church She tell me that I don't care But how am I supposed to repair something that is not there uh, And being a third wheel never makes a pair uh, That's what you call a spare Something that you keep in the trunk <laughs> Usually, uh, someone will come in here, give me an instrumental, rap over it for about 45 minutes and they're done. Same came here with uh, a computer full of loose tracks here, here, and here. He had saxophone players come in here, he had trumpet players come in here, he had American Idol contestants come up in here. Uh, it was just curveballs all day and it made my job so much more fun. When you make your own beats and you're you're writing, you're writing, you're creating the music and writing the lyrics over your own beats, you have complete control over it. You're able to drop the drums whenever you want to drop the drums. You can cut the bass out. You can do whatever you want. You know, rather when you buy a beat from someone else, it's just you're restricted to those guidelines of that beat, and you have to write to that beat. But instead, we're you know we are constantly changing the beat to go fit the lyrics, to fit the words, to fit whatever, and that gives me a lot more control and a lot more freedom to make it exactly how we want, and I think that makes it really interesting. It's four chords, baby. Oh, yeah. so. And they're pretty, too. I remember it all so clean. I remember the grass so green. I picture these things in my sweatshirt, sweet dream. I remember it all like it was yesterday, and now it's I only picture these things in my sweatshirt I smell blunt smoke, I swish your smell is so nostalgic You gotta buck, I'll break it up, it's like it's automatic, gotta have it I smell Seattle as soon as we take it out the rap zone And Martin Luther King and Cherry, I'm home Little kids around the hood making me feel hella grown It's been a minute, I've been gone, but I still call it my own Down the hill, I feel the valley living deep within me Basically what I'm doing with this is sort of creating a palette for is that right? I'm sort of creating like a palette for all these different musicians to, um, you know, be creative on and, and put their skills on, you know, so I'm combining all these skills of these incredibly talented people into this one project, into a rap which I think is awesome. It's, you know, a lot of these people only play jazz music, only sing jazz, only, you know, sing rock and roll, um, and now they're all, it's, it's all these different types of genres and types of musicians on this hip-hop album, and, um, you know, I think it can appeal to a lot of people. Live like a prince, throw parties like kids, crash parties like Vince. You know I beatbox the drums with no midi, yo. I made the beat and I directed the video. Wham, bam, what up, Gab? Get knocked out, British times over yelling, get the fuck up, lad. In a minute, all the women will fill up on all the liquor and we chilling in the middle of a pet house pad. Let's have a picnic in the park with some bitches. Ladies, get your dresses, everybody come finish. <laughs> Fucking shwit it. What's up, Seattle City? Who all up in the town? Man, I just touched down and they be like, do you understand what he say? Sam come different like ham and green eggs. <laughs> Roll a fatty, I'll pass it to Gabby who goes blicky blicky blah. What's hand in the chair? Yeah. I got those on deck. 